Hello guys, Tav HD here and welcome back to another video and today we're going to be doing an unboxing of an Apple AirTag, not a particularly exciting product or a big product in fact it's probably one of the smallest things Apple's ever made. These have been out for a few years and I finally decided to get my hands on one. I'm not going to tell you what I'm going to use it for because that would probably be a bit stupid but today I'm just going to unbox this and set it up and just go through the process. So it has a pull tab at the bottom which we can just pull and I'm guessing the bottom of the box opens. Nothing to really see on the box. There's a picture of an air tag. I don't know if that's life size. It might be so that would be quite cool. I'll compare it when I get it out I guess. The only other thing to really look at is the battery. It takes a CR2032. Other than that, that's pretty much all you need to know. So let's take this out of here. There we are. AirTag. Very straightforward and to the point. Information there, don't really care. And there we are. There is the air tag in the box and we don't get an Apple sticker as far as I can see. Back in my day everything would pretty much come with one but I'm guessing because this is just a little accessory they don't really bother. So let's take that out of there. That's a good start. <laughs> Dropping it and just out of curiosity is it the size of the picture? Yeah I think that is accurate. And actually there is something still in the box. There are multiple things still in the box that I hadn't even noticed. That box is now empty, so let's take a look at what we did get. Safety and handling, don't care. Regulatory compliance, don't care about any of that. And finally, warranty summary. So yeah, there are no Apple stickers in here, which is a bit sad, but whatever. Doesn't really matter. So let's just take a look at what it says in here. Update to the latest iOS or iPadOS, turn on Bluetooth and pull tab. And step two over here, that just says to hold near device and follow on-screen instructions. So I guess that is exactly what we're going to do. So here is my phone, it is on the latest version of iOS. Let's pull the tab on the AirTag. Pull it out. That's now activated the battery and I'm sure you heard that. Look at that straight away on screen we are getting a prompt of what to do. This is what Apple is so good at. Things just seem to work. So let's connect name AirTag custom name and I will just put that for now as test. I'm sure I can change that later. Choose an emoji unicorn. Why not? And it is linked to my Apple ID. Agree, I'll have to blur that out, of course. And it's now going to connect. There we are. It's beeped and it is now working. So, yeah, that is that. The AirTag is now set up and working. You're meant to like get an accessory to attach this to things but the accessories are more expensive than the actual AirTag itself so I'll work out something to do with this to make it work for what I want it to do. So yeah that should be all right. Okay so I've now opened it in the Find My app. I can't show this because of course it's showing my location but let's try playing sound. There we go I'm sure that is perfectly noticeable and let's try using the proximity feature to find it here it is apparently let's move it over there I wonder where it is apparently it's nearby and my phone's vibrating if we get closer it says we get closer and yeah there it is so that is literally going to be it for this video, a very straightforward little product that does exactly what it says on the tin. Hopefully these have pretty good reviews and it should work for what I need it to quite well. So thank you for watching this video, hopefully it was interesting in some way. And I'll see you in the next video which is probably going to be somewhat Apple related. This is a bit modern and out of my league in terms of Apple things but 
it's definitely good to be in the modern era, especially with something like this, you can keep a track of your property. So thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.